Hi everybody, Phil here. Welcome back to the Man Cave. Um, we got a few things we're trying to do something a little different on the show here, so we'll see how this all works out. Anyway, I'd just like to start out. Last night, uh, Kathy and I went out to see Angie, our oldest daughter, uh, singing in her band, uh, the Fifth Year Band. And uh, we had a really great time. Stayed out way too late. Maybe my uh, voice might sound a little hoarse because we were yucking it up and having a pretty good time uh, until about three in the morning. Anyway, got to see some old bandmates, so that's always nice. And, uh, you know, we just hung out and had a really good time together. But uh, on to what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm always doing stuff I'm not supposed to be doing. Um, I want to tell you about a few things that are uh, in this upcoming week. Now, here's one that, that caught my mind. Um, Mrs. Tony's Psychic Tea Party. That's uh, at 11 a.m. on Tuesdays and Thursdays. It's a gathering that features pretty dishes, enchanted herbal teas, sweet treats, and a special spiritual message. That's at the Enchanted Cove um, over on... It says 23 and a half, as though this isn't weird enough already. 23 and a half Cary Memorial Drive in uh, Pensacola. And uh, they're asking for a $10 donation. So if you're into that kind of thing, there you have it. Um, another thing I have here that's upcoming uh, this week, and uh, East Bay Babe, this is for you, at uh, St. Sylvester's Catholic Church has their annual senior bingo and luncheon at 11 a.m. on Wednesday, November 3rd at the Parish Center at St. Sylvester's Catholic Church in Gulf Breeze. Um, seniors uh, ages 55, hey, I'm getting close to that. Randy, you're there. And uh, older living in the uh, greater Navarre area. Uh, there's going to be door prizes, 50-50 drawings, obviously bingo, cash bingo, and all that kind of good stuff. So. If you like bingo, and I think you do, East Bay Babe, I'm sure you'll be there. But uh, that's going on. And then we have the annual Homemakers Holiday Craft Fair. It's from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Friday and Saturday, November 5th and 6th. That's at the Santa Rosa County Auditorium. And uh, the fair is scheduled to include crafts made by local artists, so that might be kind of cool. Homemade soups, sandwiches, desserts, and door prizes. Admission is free. Uh, so that's Friday, November 5th at 9 a.m. And Saturday, uh, November 6th at 9 a.m. Doesn't really say here. Uh, but that's at uh, 4530 Old Baghdad Highway in Milton. So if you guys uh, want to get some stuff for the holidays, what have you, make a trip on up to Milton and uh, stop in there. Another thing we have uh, coming up is uh, called Style. Uh, which I don't know if I have any or not. I, I guess I got a style. I'm, I'm not quite, <laughs> not quite sure what it is. But it's an evening of art, fashion, and music benefiting Oasis, and it's at the uh, Ramada Plaza Beach uh, Resort. It's a uh, forty-seven fifty, looks like per person, and it's the annual banquet and uh, fundraiser, and uh, they're going to have the vocalist Red is is going to be there. So that might be kind of cool. And then there's fashions by Kenneth Cole uh, Outlet Store and uh, silent auction including all kinds of art, collectibles, home decor, uh, and that kind of thing. Uh, anyway, all the uh, proceeds benefit the Oasis, HIV prevention, education, advocacy, and uh, client care programs in uh, Walton, Okaloosa, and uh, Santa Rosa uh, counties. Okay, um, last thing I got here, um, you know, I didn't even, didn't even really give this one a, a good look at it yet, but uh, it looked uh, like it might be interesting. Um, the 2010 Emerald Coast Healthy Living Expo and 5K Run Walk. Um, you know, they're all about uh, keeping you healthy, so I guess that's all good, you know. We all want to stay healthy. That's Saturday, November 6th, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the St. Mary Family Life Center at 110 St. Mary Avenue in Fort Walton Beach. Um, 
So anyway, those are a few things that are coming up. Um, I don't really think I have a lot except for to explain what's going on at that uh, event. But uh, go on out and check out some of those events. Get around the area and, uh, you know, check out what that area has. I mean, they've got all kinds of great stuff. I know it's kind of after season now. So it would be even better, you know, for somebody like me. When I come down, it's always, uh, always pretty busy uh, wherever you go. So uh, anyway, that's Phil signing off from the Man Cave. See you all next week. Back to you, Randy.